Welcome to Your Favorites by Request with me, Tim Parton. You've sent me your favorite songs, and I'm ready to play while you sing along. And if you don't remember all the words, don't worry, they're on the screen. And now, Your Favorites by Request. Your Favorites by Request. Hello again. Thank you for tuning in to Your Favorites by Request. I appreciate you watching and singing along. Poets, artists, and children have tried to describe the wonder of God's handiwork. I was recently in northern Canada where the sun stays up like I did when I was young, long past midnight, and the mighty evergreens reverently point in the direction of their great creator. Such a beautiful country our dear neighbors have up there. And I love to join in worshiping with nature as I read Psalm 96. Let the heavens rejoice, let the earth be glad, let the sea resound and all that is in it. Let the fields be jubilant and everything in them. Let all the trees of the forest sing for joy. And as I hear from you each week, I think of how wonderful it is that we are worshiping our Savior together from our little part of this great big world. This week I heard from Nikesha in Michigan, Nancy in Wisconsin, and Tristan in Florida. And I'd like to dedicate the entire program to Ross's wife, who's celebrating her 81st birthday. Happy birthday. But first, Anne Marie in Jamaica requested the song with lyrics that paint such a, ma a masterpiece of this universe that belongs to my very own father. This is my father's world. my 
Just to think. 
about that and sing it one more time. The wonder of it all, the wonder of it all, just to think that God loves me. The wonder of it all, the wonder of it all, just to think. Hi, and welcome back. This part of the program is one of my favorite parts of the program, but it's probably a little self-indulgent. I love to talk to people that are friends of mine or mentors or um, fellow musicians, and um, I hope that it's something that maybe you can connect with in terms of the, the way the music has touched these people's lives, and they have, they're people who are in the industry, music industry, and so uh, I have a friend today that is more than a musical friend, although she is well known for her music, but she has become just a sweetheart friend that I can talk to, and that's, that's the kind of person that I love to, to get to know, to, to share music with, and then uh, when we step away from music, we can talk about the rest of life. So uh, you know this dear friend, her name is Yvonne Lewis, and I want to uh, talk to her right now, okay? Let's do that. Yvonne, are you there? I am. Hey, hey Yvonne. Tim. You're a sweetheart. I love your smile. You could just stand there and smile and, and you wouldn't even have to sing, but I love your singing too. So it's oh, like, oh, okay. you know, you can Enjoy smile and sing. So, so. <laughs> Well, praise the Lord. It's so good to be with you today. Awesome. Well, uh, you have such a, an amazing history in music. And, uh, and yet you're so young, uh, so oh, I Oh, <laughs> you know what, Tim? That's why I love you. <laughs> well, so tell me a little bit about uh, how, where you uh, have gone in music. Tell me about your music path. Well, the Lord allowed me to have some really interesting experiences in music. I started in the late 70s, and I had an opportunity to sing with some of the industry's finest um, artists and producers and I did a lot of jingles like Ruffles Potato Chips and um, Diet Coke and Burger King and Pizza Hut and just a lot of different things <laughs> and so um, it's a pretty varied it was a pretty varied life but a career I should say but it was not it didn't meet my soul's needs yeah. You know, it was great financially, it was very lucrative, I met some great people, but it just wasn't meeting my, my soul need. Sure. But I loved, I loved what I was doing, and, and um, as far as the jingles were concerned, especially because, you know, you just go in, you work, and you leave, and right. so, and then you get residuals <laughs> on what you did in an hour, right. so Smart. I mean, it's kind of like, okay, I like that. <laughs> That's good. But again, you know, I wouldn't, I would not trade working for the Lord and singing for the Lord right. and, and doing programming for the Lord. I wouldn't trade that with, you know, my life from before for anything. Sure. You couldn't pay me. Sure. 
Well, I know that there are a lot of people that I've talked to that want to know how to break into the music business, even as far as uh, singing gospel music. And mm -hmm. so uh, it's just uh, interesting to me, you know, all the, 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 of the people that I talk to uh, at, in this segment of the program, uh, they have been able to make a living with music. And I, I, I just kind of think it's important for people to see that, it's, um, that it can be, God, God gives us these things to, um, he, he knows what he's doing. For me personally, yeah. I know that um, music is, a, is all I know. So um, I have to pay somebody to mow the yard and change the oil and do all the things that I don't know how to do. Um, so, <laughs> but, but he is so good to give us the things that he knows we need, the tools, the gifting. That, yeah. um, and so for you, I have seen, um, you know, you use and change the audience's um, demeanor whenever you step on stage and you sing. I have seen their faces uh, just... Uh, brighten because uh, of your of your voice and I know that's the Spirit of God through you and I know you give him all the glory for that yes uh, praise the Lord. and so now Absolutely. now he has opened the door for you to be the general manager of dare to dream yes and you get to use that gift that maybe is something you didn't know you had um, <laughs> I, I don't want to put words in your mouth but um, uh, so anyway, I just love the fact that you're, uh, you, you're a great singer and you're just a wonderful person. So um, thank you for, for that. And, and do you happen to have a, a, maybe a favorite song, something we could sing together? Because I would be honored. Oh, I would be honored. Um, how about Softly and Tenderly, Jesus is Calling? That's awesome. I love that song, Softly and Tender. Sweet. So very much for singing along with me. God bless you. Thank we'll you talk to you Lord. soon. Thank you for having me. God bless you. You're welcome. Thanks. Bye-bye. I love this song. Jesus is the sweetest name I know. There have been names that I have loved to hear, but never has there been a name so dear. This heart of mine as the name divine, the precious, precious name of Jesus. Jesus is the sweetest name. It's the 
Someone so dear as Jesus is to me, I can't help but sing. I encourage you again to send in your requests. Let me know what your favorite song is. And until I hear from you, I'm going to keep on singing just like this. Jesus, Jesus. 